intro song. New song, new intro, new background to start off this new phase in my YouTube channel. Welcome. We're gonna talk about my skin today and a product that I've been putting on at night to make my skin issues better. <laughs> so mine isn't sensitive skin, acne, whiteheads, blackheads, it's none of that. It's basically a problem that I create on my own by having this issue where I pick at my skin, which is so nasty. <laughs> <laughs> That's just the truth of it, and if this video is going to be helpful for anyone, you're going to have to know the full 100% truth of it. Sometimes I get breakouts, I get blackheads sometimes, but my biggest issue is one that I create for myself, and it's this teeny little pimple that would literally go away within the same day, same hour, but I make it an issue because I mess with it. Or as Khaki would say, I mash it. <laughs> What she calls it. There are so many products out there that like dry pimples or like prevent breakouts. I tried to find something because I knew that wasn't my issue. I'm like, well, I could try and put that product on my skin, but it'll probably just make it worse because it's basically like a boo-boo now. It's like a, a wound now. If you put like Neosporin on it, Neosporin clogs pores, so like you don't want to put that on your face. And there was just like I couldn't figure out how to make it better because for me anyway, if you also have this issue where you like turn nothings into somethings on your face, it's a cycle. Like the worse your skin gets, the more you do this. So it just makes it even worse. You know what I mean? And then if your skin gets like a lot better, you're less inclined. It's like, I don't know if it's for me like a stress thing, I think it is, or like a control thing. So the better my skin gets, the better my problem gets and so I just I needed something that would make it better I finally was just like I'm gonna get this product which is rose hip seed oil I have it from the brand the ordinary because it's like 10 bucks and it's just straight the oil like there's nothing else in it because I saw all these pictures of people with like cystic acne that's more I, it's still not what I had but it was closer it was like you know something that needed to heal is the best way to put it. Like, I have all the stuff on my face that needs to heal, and I have been taking pictures for about two and a half to three months, um, and you can see that it's a roller coaster. It doesn't just exponentially get better, like, every single picture is like, wow, look at those results, because I'm human and I have this habit that I'm trying to break, so sometimes I mess up and you regret it, but that just fuels next time, hopefully, that you won't do it again. So, you can see that there are new new little things popping up, but overall, you can see that it gets so much better, and it's very healing. Like, it enhances the healing process, if that makes sense. I think this is absolutely something that you should try if you have the issues that I do. It doesn't clog my pores at all. The only downside of it is you kind of smell like pizza or like food because <laughs> it I don't know how to describe the smell it's just a little savory smelling um but it's worth it like if I have to go to bed smelling like pizza and I wake up with better skin in the morning so be it so I always put it on every single night I do the rest of my skincare routine which also has been like a huge part of why my skin's gotten better. I want to do a video on my skincare routine too, so if you're interested in that, let me know in the comments below and I'll definitely do that as well. It's really simple. I'm a low maintenance type of person, so I have like three things I use, like my cleanser, moisturizer, and this oil. So, and I just wanted to show you what it looked like. So it's a little eyedropper. And it's very yellow <laughs> but anyway and I go to sleep and in the morning it's usually a lot better things don't hurt as much um, it's like not as irritated it's calmed down like I just feel like it's kind of like a magical oil and um, I used oils in the past and they broke me out because they clogged your pores so this is what do they call it non comedogenic or something and the oil keeps it really moisturized so you know 
Anyway, <laughs> where am I even going with this? There would be some times that I'd doubt it and I'd be like, is this really helping? Maybe if I just take a break and use like a different moisturizer or if I don't use anything at all, maybe it'll be better. It never was. I always use this. It just... I love it so much. I feel like there aren't enough videos out there talking about it. I know there are like pictures, but I thought this would be a better like personalized story time of it kind of so you can hear my story and go, wow, that's so similar to mine. Maybe this will help me too. Because I know how it feels to get kind of trapped in the cycle of my skin looks so bad, I'm even more stressed. I might as well just like mash them, pick at them, whatever. Um, it's already bad, what am I gonna do, make it worse, like it's like not even possible, like that's the feeling that you have. And then like you want to not wear makeup to let it all heal, but then you feel so bad, it's just such a terrible cycle, <laughs> like even thinking about it right now, I'm like, but hopefully you can give this product a shot since it's so cheap too, $10, $10. and if it works for you, it'll change a lot, yeah. But anyway, let me know if you like my new intro and my new spot. I really like it. Rain or Shine, I'll have a video next week. Don't miss it because it'll probably be mediocre.